Okay, got this all ready to go in. I welded a nut on the back side of this. Send a bit of the paint off there. We're going to plug weld it. And it's all ready to go in. You weld it in there. So I'm going to do that right now. So I got, I just got real lucky, I think. Um, so when I was welding this out here, I noticed that this was getting kind of hot and this, the paint was bubbling here. So I grabbed my, uh, I got a spray pump up here. And uh, I got these, two of these spray pumps. And you can see they're identical other than this one says water on it. This one has wax and grease remover on it. In it. Um, anyways, uh, for some reason I put this one down on the cement just over here where I was working. And uh, so when I noticed that spot getting hot there, I grabbed it and it on there you know and it just kind of did what water does it, it's hot so it evaporates quickly so then I carried on welding and and uh, this I was a little concerned because I had just painted this inside and there's a possibility of it you know catching on fire well I shouldn't say I just painted it I painted it last week but and then there this area here you know, I couldn't really see what was back in there, and it's kind of close to where the trunk area is. So I'm always kind of concerned that, you know, it's something might catch on fire in there. So as soon as I was done, like I, I kept looking to see if there was any smoke coming out of the car. So as soon as I was done, I grabbed that what I thought was water, and I opened the trunk, <clears throat> and uh, look. Quite a bit of smoke came out, so I thought, oh, maybe there is a little fire down there. So I took that spray pump, which I thought had water in it, and I sprayed some of it down there, and this sort of weird, well, solvent fumes came at me. You know, I could smell, I could smell a bit of that, you know, paint thinner smell when I was welding, but I just thought, I just thought that it was because I'd painted in there and there's all that stuff that ran out on that board. And in fact, there was a little, little spot right where that, right where that puddle is there. I've since sprayed some water in there, but where that little puddle, it was, it was actually on fire. And I just thought it was the solvent in that, in that board and it had come out. And anyway, so I think what, what a guy needs to do is uh, get a completely different colored uh, sprayer for the water or I could paint that one a different color or whatever but uh, it's just a bit of a lesson and I got off easy because it didn't start on fire imagine having a fire and thinking you got water and spraying spraying that stuff on it that would have been disastrous especially if my head's down in that trunk there and man Anyway, be careful guys. Today I am going to uh, put some filler on this quarter section here and this rocker panel. And you see how wavy that is across this uh, seam right here. Uh, before I saw this car, somebody had replaced the rocker panels. And the weird thing is they welded them on right here, right at the door opening, the door gap. Uh, I, I found it hard to believe that this piece, this cord, uh, rocker panel didn't come with this whole section here. I, I, I've never seen a rocker panel end there. And I don't think, I mean, maybe they're homemade ones. But I kind of don't think they were. I, um, just going by what the owner said, he said that they 
source these rocker panels somewhere. Unless they were not for a Plymouth and they adapted them somehow to fit this car, but I still, you know, I still would never put a weld seam there. Um, at least take it up to this one inside. Uh, I don't know, I just, I don't really know what went on, so I can't really say a whole lot. I've said enough, I think. But, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and put some filler on these, on this area here. You can see it's really wavy there, where the weld seam is. A um, little wavy all along here. So I'm going to put some fiberglass filler on that. I'm going to put a, a band of fiberglass filler on here. And get this all get this all covered up. I just wanna want to uh, finish this body work on this uh, section here, and uh, then I'm gonna put the door back on.